what is good it is also gaming back again i am back commentating i'm commentating over the xenoverse 2 beta who this this was amazing this was amazing i'm here fighting my boy prime senju uh i've been wanting to fight him for the longest because uh we all know how good xenoverse 1's fighting was so I decided to give him a taste of the Xenoverse 2 with a much smoother fighting style. I have to tell you guys, I love it. I'm going to get this game. It is a must-have if you like anime gaming. Um, uh, I've developed my own skill, I should say, using what I knew from Xenoverse 1. I didn't play much of the story. That's why I don't have uh, all the characters. Like, I don't think I have a Zarbon. So, uh, and I don't have all the ghosts and stuff. I didn't play through the whole story mode. I don't have time, basically. Because of the server issues, I wasn't able to log on at all. And then, when I did log on, um, I don't want to waste my time. So, I played through a little bit of story, get used to those fighting mechanics, um, see what I'm getting into in the future. I uh, recorded a little bit of that, too. Um, yeah. And, um, I have two characters as of now. I'm not fighting Prime Sinjo on this account. I don't really know why. No, that was a fierce blast battle there. I almost broke his stamina so close, but he broke mine first. He had a little bit more stamina than me. Um, I'm in quite the deficit here. But let's see if we can bring back. I have missed doing this so much. I got the music. I got the fighting. It is hot today. <laughs> um, yes, this was so much fun doing this. So much fun I had. Um, here I do a double break strike. Hoping to get out the final flash. And I do successfully. Um, I think Prime Shinju did import his moves. I did not have my imported moves because... I did not play Xenoverse 1 on this account, what Prime Sinju did was me and him got together and I got on my other account where I actually did play Xenoverse and me and him basically grinded through some parallel quests, I got him that move right there, that blaster shell, and I was trying to get another move, I never really got it, but um, it doesn't matter anyway because, uh, like I said, I was only able to play this for a day. Basically, in less than a day, really, because that day I had school. So, yeah, that was that. Was that. Um, I was loving it the time I did play. It was amazing. When I got a, when I was able to fly around Canton City, that was also amazing. It was, this game, this game was one of the best fighting experiences. We didn't, I didn't know if he was going random or what. I was just picking characters that I wanted to, um... See how they change who they play that. So <laughs> turned out weird how Gohan is fighting Piccolo here. But um, yeah. So he actually has an energy charge. Piccolo has a faster energy charge than Gohan. So what I did was around time where his energy was getting full. I, that's when I charged in. Um, Gohan has quite the speed, which I noticed in this. <coughs> Sorry. Gohan has quite the speed, which I noticed. Um, I was loving these games that I played. It, uh, it was fun. Um, this game is going to take over Storm 4 for a while. I don't know how long. Chill Road to Boruto comes up probably. But I'll still have those sprinkled Storm 4 videos in there. Because I don't know if I will ever be as good as Universe 2 as I am in Storm 4, I am a seasoned um, player uh, oh, player of Naruto games. I've been playing since generations. So, that game holds a very special place in my heart, being the end of the Storm. Uh, sort of the end, because Rose of Warzone is still coming out, but that's an expansion pack, if you will. But that game will always hold that special place in my part. I'm excited to see if anything new comes for the Naruto community. Even though the anime's ended, they have to. Naruto's a moneymaker. <laughs> People will buy it as long as they produce more content. Um, speaking of that, let's get into the latest episodes of Xenoverse.
now. Or I mean, not Xenoverse. Wow, um, Dragon Ball Super. I'm not gonna spoil it. I'm just gonna um for you guys who did watch it, you'll know what I'm talking about. These last couple episodes have been amazing. If you haven't watched them, you should go watch them. They are full of things I've wanted to see for a while. They are uh, pretty fun. Um, I am. They have me on my seat at the end of every episode wanting to see the next one and that's one of the things I really love about Dragon Ball Super is that they make me want to see more is that they going to make me uh continue watching the series as as I finish that up Naruto coming to a close um I'm not sure if that was the last episode the last episode that aired I don't believe so possibly not um I think they're actually going to go into Naruto or the last in the creation of Boruto. That's what I am thinking. I don't know if they're going to go on a hiatus, um, make it like another season or whatever. And by another season, I mean like season 5, season 6, season 7. Um, here, Prime has to do something real quick. I didn't, he didn't say it on the mic or anything. So I was just sitting, <laughs> waiting, letting time run out. But funny enough, he came back right as time ran out, so... I guess that was good. Uh, I was able to go on my little spiel there about Dragon Ball Super. And now I'm going to move over to the Naruto community. Now I loved, 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 loved the animation. Uh, everything about these last couple episodes, the final fight was amazing. Now what interests me the most is Sasuke becoming the Wandering Ninja. What I'm wondering is, did he and Sakura already, you know, or is that going to, is Sasuke going to come back at a later date? Um, like, it could be around the time of, well, Sakura is like 12, though, if you think about it. So, she is like 12, right? I'm not sure. I just know Sakura is uh, a little bit, she's not a baby, she's not a kid. So, so, um, Naruto is, I believe, 16 or 18, I always forget how old Naruto is, but I'm not sure how old he is when he becomes Hokage, but I'm wondering when the creation, well, I know Boruto is created after the last, he takes place, so I'm wondering if when Sasuke, well, that's another thing, so, if you've seen the last movie, when Sasuke appears for those brief moments, he is wearing the the last costume, I guess you called it, where it's basically brown, right? But here, um, this shouldn't spoil too much, but basically, when Sasuke left the village, he was wearing his wandering ninja costume with the uh, with the black. So if you have Stone Forward, you've already seen most of those costumes, most likely. So that was what Sasuke was wearing. So I'm wondering if, if <coughs> he comes back to the village around the time where Naruto, the last movie, takes place. And that's when him and Sasuke get it. Or it will be shortly after that. Well, maybe even shortly before that. Maybe Sasuke's on the down low. Takes this in the village says hello to his baby Sakura and has a nice time with her <laughs> so yeah um, I'm interested to see how that goes um here I missed with the ultimate he vanishes at the wrong time man the wrong time when I was about to get the ultimate off there I was able to hit him with the gallic gun that moves up. they may they spit up the moves it seems very very quickly now it seems they're more fluent as I press them. Um, well, you of course can still charge them up. Here, I had, didn't have enough stamina to do anything. Uh, he hit me with that move. I still don't know what that move's called. But um, I don't have a lot of stamina, so my goal is the perfect block. Get in there, break his stamina. I didn't break his stamina. I hit him with hard hit, but I did not break his stamina, sadly. Which was <laughs> um, kind of bad for me. Um, he has stamina, I don't. Try to hit him with the final flash, but that did not work out. Here, I grabbed him and then I died. <laughs> I guess it was some sort of glitch, as they did not calculate the damage properly. 
it shows him dying, and then it shows me dead. So that was a little bit of a glitch, but um, yeah. So it was pretty fun playing in here. I still got a little bit left in this video, and so uh, I'm not really sure what I'm going to talk about. It's going to have to come to my head very quickly. <laughs> Because, um, yeah, gotta keep on, the commentary keep on with my flow. So, I know, um, Sweetest Day just passed. Um, so, anyone have a special someone who they, uh, did something special for? Um, or did you get something special done for you? Tell me in the comments below. That would be interesting. That would be nice to read. That would be nice to, uh, see. Um, me personally, um, I'll say things are complicated <laughs> but um yeah but, uh, it was it was nice looking at people's stories on that day looking at people's Instagram posts that Twitter posts um, a lot of single salty people <laughs> I don't get it. I'm not one of those people who when I'm single I get jealous at other relationships or I say other relationships don't work out just because mine didn't but uh <laughs> yeah um, I'm not sure if I won at all at this point against Prime Sinju. Now here he has Skrill and I have Super Saiyan 3, or not Super Saiyan 3, uh, Goku GT. Now, I really want to get this game for other guys, like, really bad. I'm trying, I'm going for this Friday. Going for the 18th, alright? Or not the 18th, the, uh, um, this Friday, what is this Friday? Today is the 19th, 20th, 21st, the 21st, and the 21st, um, I didn't know this was Spirit Bomb, I thought it was Spirit Ball, but I didn't know he had to target that long, so that was, um, my little mistake there, I was luckily able to block that Kamehameha, barely had enough stamina left, um, after that, so that allowed Prime Sinner to go in there and get some damage. Um, looks like that didn't connect, but it did connect, in fact, um, he is the, or he tries for the Kamehameha there, um, I go for the power pull, I've been training with the Nimbus guys, the Nimbus is not that bad of a transformation, as it may seem, um, very good against great apes, I have found, um, well, early game, I don't know about later games, because I haven't been to later game yet, but I found early game that Flying Nimbus is very good. You can keep your distance um, if someone uh, spamming you. Keep your distance pretty well. I didn't connect that. That wasn't the best thing for me. I wish it would have connected. I don't know why. I, I was trying to do that teleportation thing where you like vanish as you move. Basically, that's what I was trying to do. <laughs> but I couldn't figure out how to do it. Uh, blast another time to have me haw his way. Luckily, I think he wants to hit me, but he messed it up and used the free blast instead. And so, Super Saiyan 3 has its power, definitely. I was able to hit him with the power pole first before he could get his Kamehameha up. Very good for me. Um, this is not the last battle. We have one more. Wait, this is the last battle. Uh-oh. So, if I don't win this, I would have had won any battles against Prime Sinju. Which uh, won't be very fun. And also, um, I kind of recorded my reactions to first getting on the Xenoverse servers. Uh, this is back when they were still laggy and glitchy. So, um, I don't know if I'm going to upload it. I may, I might, might upload them. But, and I might not. But uh, we will see about that. We got 15 seconds in this fight. What I need to do is I need to get some damage on him, or else I will lose. Uh, I did that teleportation <coughs> thing, not sure how I did that. Um, luckily for me, I blocked that move. Damn, in a break. One second left. Who won? Let's see. I won one round against Prime Sinju. This has been Also Gaming. If you liked the video at all, remember to leave a like and subscribe if you're new. This has been Also Gaming, and I will see you.